welcome back to my channel. Hope you all are doing well. This is another pregnancy video and this is all about the three items I have found absolutely essential during my pregnancy this far and a couple other items that I have found useful as well. So I'm 24 weeks today or yesterday and these are items that I've used almost daily. So stay tuned if you're interested to see what I have found so helpful so far. The first item is da -da -da, a sleeping eye mask. I never had one of these before I got pregnant, but all right, so check it out, something like this. This one's super soft. I got it from Amazon for like seven bucks, I think. Um, so obviously it just blocks out all light. I've It's been unbelievable how tired I've been, especially the first trimester. Um, and this just kind of helps me fall asleep faster, I feel like. It's easier to zone out, it's so dark. Uh, it's easier to kind of get in the nap mode, and so it's been helpful to, for me to nap anytime using that. I brought it with me on my vacation. It's been wonderful. So I would definitely recommend getting one of those and it's pretty cheap. Okay, the second thing is an app. I know there are so many apps about pregnancy and baby stuff, uh, but this one I found particularly great and it's free of course because I'm cheap like that. This app has um, every week it shows you how big your baby is compared to a size of fruit. So I'll see if you guys can see it. Um, if you can see that, my baby this week is the size of a cantaloupe, so it's been really cute to watch it get bigger and bigger from like the size of an apple to the size of a coconut to the size of a cantaloupe. Um, that's been exciting to see the growth. And it used to, it stopped doing this around 22 weeks. Uh, so I thought maybe that was a bad omen, but I think maybe it just does that. Uh, it used to every day give you a new fact, like today your baby's hand is the size of an M&M or something cute like that. And I would share it with Alex and he loved to hear it too, so that's a really fun thing to share with your partner. There's also a cool 3D aspect of this app. Um, so every week you can kind of see what your baby looks like in 3D. Uh, it's just kind of a generic 34 week baby. But I don't know if you guys can see that. You can like rotate it around. Uh, so that's been really cool. There's also really relevant information all in this one spot about everything pregnancy and parenthood related. And it kind of goes along the journey with you. So when you're around 12 weeks, it's talking about um, when to tell people uh, what to do with all the icky symptoms that you're experiencing. And as you get further along, it's like what to look for in maternity leave or what questions to ask your pediatrician. So really relevant information. And I remember once there was a symptom I had that I was kind of concerned about. And I was able to search on the app and see other people's responses. So... Like I said, it's a great little community. It's called The Bump, and I've found it super helpful. I know other people have used it as well. Okay, third thing that has really helped me so far has been these little guys. Breezies. So I think I get these at Walmart. They're a bag for uh, like three bucks, and there's a ton of them in there. To be honest, I don't really like half of the colors. I really like stick to the pink, red, blue, purple. So the greens and the oranges kind of get thrown out. I'm sorry to say. But several aspects of these have been helpful and I'll tell you why. It is the summer right now in Minnesota so it's really hot and humid so these are a really quick way to cool down. I find myself getting um, hotter, hotter more quickly than usual so these are a good way to cool down pretty uh, quickly. They are easy on the stomach when I've been nauseous. Um, when I was kind of in my saltines phase, I was able to stomach these pretty well. And you're also getting a little bit of hydration and it's increasing your blood sugar a little bit. They're not super healthy, but they're not that many calories either. So I found these to be really helpful when I've been feeling really hot or kind of sick or I didn't really want to eat anything, but I wanted something um, to kind of increase my blood sugar. So these freezies have been just a godsend. Two other things that I wanted to just kind of mention, that I have found them as, as essential, but they've been really nice is to have a yoga mat around, even if you don't exercise that much, it's been so helpful to be able to get on the yoga mat and just do a couple stretches. I'll Google like prenatal yoga poses. And your body just kind of feels less tight and um, better afterwards. There's some great yoga poses for back pain. So it's been really helpful for me. I sometimes I do a couple poses before bed and it really does relax my body. And if you're more into exercise, then you can do some prenatal Pilates, kind of keep your body more in shape, uh, prevent some of that pregnancy weight gain. And then um, it also helps prepare your body for birth, doing some of these yoga poses, some hip opening poses. So Google, make sure all your um, exercises are pregnancy approved. But I think it's been really helpful for me so far, and I hope that there's a good payoff in the end for doing all this too. And then the last thing are these little sheet masks. 
I have Alex just buy me like a bundle of them from Amazon. This one's a Dermal brand and this one's Nature Republic. They come in big packs and it's kind of fun to see the different varieties and flavors of the mask. This one's pomegranate, this one's rose. And the reason I like using these is it's nice to do something kind of pampering for yourself when you're pregnant and something that's good for your skin while you're feeling kind of self-conscious about everything. And then it also forces you to just like chill out. Sometimes I get so panicked about trying to get stuff done and I think it's really important for your body to just kind of take it easy and rest uh, when you're growing a life. So you put one of these on you're kind of stuck in that position for 15 to 20 minutes. So I like these to kind of slow down, relax, they're a nice little way to pamper yourself. And I think that's it. So just to review, Sleeping Eye Mask, the app, the bump, and freezies have been a must have for me and then sheet masks and yoga mat are really nice things to have on hand as well. Let me know what you found to be really helpful when you were pregnant and um, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.